to do another black and white from the series. Not sure how this one's gonna turn out. I'm running thin on paints. That's why I went ahead and uh, put what I could on there. I had enough to cover, but I figured I'd go ahead and shoot it anyway. Just trying to get my uh, gloves pulled apart and put back on. <laughs> oh, this conservation is lovely. But we should conserve anyway, right? Oh, there went a hole in my glove, but that's okay. I don't mind a blue thumb. <laughs> Most people would want a green thumb, but a blue thumb, that'll work. And yes, that's what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to be using blues. I have not decided if I wanted to throw a silver in there or not, because I do like, uh, I really do like my silvers. Trying to blow the glove back out. <clears throat> it's one I was using earlier. And I had to stop in a in a rush, so I didn't get to wash them off. There we go. I just pray now this comes off on to, to this canvas. Okay, I am so hoping. I should have plenty of white, um, uh, should have plenty of white. So we're going to go ahead and, and do this and see how it's going to work. I don't need this. There we go. Okay. Oh, that's quite a bit in that corner, but you need them beside each other. And with them coming out of the cup, quite a bit more comes out <laughs> than what you might want or expect. <sighs> I did kind of want this more of a, I don't know, I could, all I could think of when I see it, it's like a tuxedo. <laughs> I know, it's me. It's just me. I'm sure you guys can see it too. It's just that it's the angle. So I'm going to blow the white and hope this cover and we'll go ahead and get it all uh all ready for the blues. Dripsies there, and the last time I did that, it came out looking like eyelash. <laughs> so we're gonna leave it alone, so we don't just touch it and it hide underneath. We're just gonna leave it up top and see what's going to happen with this one. I'm excited, and it doesn't matter if it's even. It's it's art. It doesn't have to be perfect with a. a Exact measurement. And I'm just putting it on here. I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to blow it out yet. And by the way, I did not mention 
Um, the white is Artist Loft white. The black is Artist Loft. I also have Greenish Blue by Amsterdam. Cerulean Blue Hue by Liquitex Basics. Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue. Artist Loft, Artist Loft. And this is a Premier Deep Turquoise. I also had mixed in, oh, oh, it just rolled right into it like a magnet. Um, an Apple Barrel Deep Navy that I had left and all those I added a little iridescent medium from Artist Loft so they will all shine. And of course, if I use the silver, um, that is of course metallic. Let's get busy here. Let's see. Is the other. You never know, the blue might take over the whole entire canvas. Now I was having difficulty with the last one, but I think it was, uh, I'm not sure what it was. I was, it might've been, uh, I think there's a clump in there. I think it may have been, uh, one of my paints it was just too thin. And that might've been why the reds kind of blended in so much, but it's looking good. No, it's not dry yet. You will know when it's dry. Now, do I want to add the silver? Some people would go, yes, yes. Some people would go, no, no. I'm gonna add a little bit of it because I just cannot resist. Because either way, it's like a gray. Hopefully it don't take over. Of course, we have to have a drizzle, a drizzle mizzle. Oh, why? And I wish I had more black, but uh, I just keep making a mess here. <laughs> it's fun, but I might need to uh, take a break if I'm making that much of a mess all over the black side. to black. Oh. Well, we're gonna see what this does. Hopefully not try to blow what's left of my paint everywhere. Okay. Moment of truth. I like them colors just like that. Can I just leave it like that? <laughs> Which way am I going to blow? That one, I want to come back this way, but um, my floor may have um, other ideas for that. <laughs> Let's see. This is so close to the edge, and I don't want to take you guys out of view. I may have to slide it down just a little bit. Okay. So, 
here goes nothing. We're just gonna Okay, I like it. <laughs> I like it. it. It literally looks like a V. I like it. Um, I have a few pieces. I need to figure out how I'm going to take care of this black over here on this side. It's mixed with the white, and the white drops here. And uh, hopefully, it's not going to cause me to have to go and redo it. Let's see. definitions what I wanted uh, I don't know why I did that kind of offset it I guess maybe I shouldn't have done that might be too late now to go back there's uh, so much pain on here I am more happy with it than not. Um, and you know the rules of that game. It's just kind of come all the way out here. Just that little piece is just all out there. I am so out of black, guys. Okay, let's see if I can dab them little white dots. Non-intended white dots. This is just, 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 just way too much white in here. Mm. I had a drip of white in there, that's what my problem is. With that side, um, so I may have to uh, pick some more black here because this is, I don't want to mess this up. It is so pretty and I'm just thinning out the black on this one side and not going to make me happy.
You may just have to leave that little swirly of white in there and be done with it. Good playing with it. There just a little bit. Yeah, that's better. All righty. I love my blues. Who doesn't love blue? There might be a few people out there who don't love blue, but it's okay. To each their own, right? I'm in love with the blues. That's crazy. I didn't even put any brown in there. I'm not sure what that is. I didn't put gold in there either. Hmm. But it looks like it decided it wanted to make a little gold because that's not silver. It looks gold. Or like a... A rose gold. Torchy, 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 torchy. All right. I need my glasses on so I can see everything that's going on. Come on. in the bubbles. <laughs> I don't see some cell action happening up there. That is something else. It's like my favorite area up there. Let's see. It's just the way it said. I love that right there. I don't know why I didn't do it all over. Maybe... Just the way I blew it out, I'm guessing. Because um, normally I like those flower petals that go. I would have needed to dig down and get a little more white to go that way. But I know if I would have blown this more, it would have covered up too much of that white. And I would have wound up doing it again. Because there would not have been enough negative white there. Hmm. So... I'm going to pause you and get you down so hopefully it doesn't make you dizzy and give you a close-up. Okay, guys, this is on uh, the opposite side. Let's see. Here we go. Zoom in a little bit. Look at them cells. Looks like water flowing. But like I said, I did not put gold, I put silver. So if anyone knows why that happened, please feel free to let me know. I wasn't expecting it. Look at that. Just lovely. Let's see. The other group of cells it looks like a little puppy paw. Oh, wow. Is that like a dragon head right there? Maybe. Let's see. And I got you way zoomed in here. Look at that, so pretty. Right there, the little cells, these cells. You know, it's such a see I that's the one I said. I might just leave that little splash there. And I'm noticing I have a little more than one little splash as I zoom in and show you, like, uh, right there is a little splash. But those little splashes is what makes it, whoops, unique. Let me zoom back out, turn it to the side for you. Yes, it looks like a V. Let's 
noticing in the, any other irid. I wonder if that's what happened. It was the iridescence, which I would have to do that probably in better lighting or like the sunlight. So to find any shimmer in it, I'm going to let this dry and I'll be back to show it to you when it's dry. Bye for now. Thank you.